Murder at Yellowstone City is an old-fashioned western. In fact, it's almost like you have to squint your eyes to make sure this wasn't made in the 1960s. You don't see a lot of movies like this anymore, and it's got a big-name cast, so I was pretty excited for it. You've got Thomas Jane, Gabrielle Byrne, Anna Camp, so some heavy hitters here. The problem is, it's a mystery film without much of a mystery. You really know what's going on the whole time. There's not really any twists. There's some cool gunfighting scenes in there, but not really enough to carry it through. This really could have been like a 25-minute film, unfortunately. The story is about a prospector who strikes gold in Montana during a gold rush and he's killed everybody blames a slave who's played by Isaiah Mustafa his name Cicero especially Sheriff James Ambrose who's played by Gabrielle Byrne so the whole town is against him due to racism and all sorts of issues but then you've got Thomas Jane who's the new minister and his wife Anna played by Anna Camp they come to his defense and they kind of sort out the mystery, but really it's just an excuse to get a lot of people shooting guns at each other. These are the sorts of movies that used to be moved, made at old Tucson back in the day. It's kind of a shame they aren't anymore. But I didn't like this movie very much. I'm giving it two stars out of four. Feel Real, Kagan 9, on your side.